If you remember very well, last week we were adding on a number line. So this week we are going to be subtracting on the number line. We said when we add on a number line, when we add on the number line, we move forward. So today as we are subtracting on a number line, which means we are moving backwards. So I'll take for an example, the sum four subtract two. How do we do it? As we did last week, we take the first number, which is four, and we plot it on the number line. There we go. So we are subtracting. So when we are subtracting, we move backwards. So how many times are we going to move backwards? We take the next number, which is two, which means we are moving two times backwards. One, two, and we end at the number two. So which means four subtract two is Two. Let's take the second example, which is eight, take away five. We find the number eight on our number line. Sorry, there we go. There's our number eight over there. Remember, whenever we are subtracting, we move backwards. And when we are adding, we move forward. Okay, so we found the number eight on our number line over there. And then, this is going to tell us that we are moving backwards because it is a subtraction sign. So how many times are we moving backwards? We are moving backwards five times. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five. And we end at the number three. So which means eight subtract five is a three. Let's take another one because as I said before, practice makes perfect. We take the first number again, which is number 10. We find it on our number line. Here's our number 10 over there. So again, this sign is going to lead us as to are we moving forward or backwards? So we are moving backwards because it is a subtraction sign. So from number 10, we are moving backwards how many times? Six times. One, two, three, four, five, and six. So we add and at number four. So which means 10 subtract six is four. Now let's take the last example, which is seven take away seven. We find our number seven on the number line. Here we go, there's it over there. And we are going to move how many times? We are going to move seven times. We ask ourselves, are we moving forward or backwards? So the subtraction sign tells us that we are moving backwards. How many times? Seven times. From number seven, one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. We end at zero. So which means seven, take away seven, is a zero. Thank you very much and do enjoy your day.